Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to do a video about Viva. So for all of you that don't know what Viva is, Viva is a rockabilly vintage weekender festival that happens at the New Orleans Hotel in Las Vegas. So I have never been before and I've always wanted to go and I wanted to go this year but because we were moving house and then our dogs, we have four dogs you guys, and we had so much work to do that we didn't think we could make it but we decided the Friday night before the car show on the Saturday that we would book tickets for the car show and we would go. We have got the tickets you guys! So for us, it's a four hour drive, maybe a four and a half hour drive. And we just decided last minute, spontaneously, we're gonna go. And I was so excited for it, but I was also like, whoa, did we really just book this and we're gonna be leaving in five hours? Yeah, but <laughs> we made it work and we went along. But I don't know if I mentioned it before, but Viva, they have pool parties, car shows, pin-up contests, swimsuit contests, dancing, the, so many bands that you can dance all the way through the night and it's just so much fun. And you get to see everybody's outfits, which is amazing. And it literally makes you feel that you're back in the 50s. Just, I don't know, it's, it's so bizarre. It's that way that you have to see some of my footage just to kind of see what it really is and what it's like. But without further ado, here is my vlog. Hi everyone, so we are finally on our way to Viva and we are about to head out on our four hour car journey, which we're not looking forward to, but we are definitely looking forward to going to Viva because we have never been, as I said before. So it's all exciting, all new and we can't wait to be there and to experience it. So yeah, here's to the journey. <laughs> also, I want to point out that I feel kind of silly today because it is so cold here and in grey <laughs> and I've got a little halter neck top, halter neck top on and white shorts. So it doesn't really feel like a tire for Delhi weather today but it's meant to be really warm in Vegas and there's bumps in the road so we are bouncing about right now um, so hopefully it's warm in Vegas or else I'm going to freeze <laughs> just waiting at McDonald's because it's the only place there is to eat on the road to Vegas right now so and we are so hungry that we had to stop so yeah, only an hour and a half in, so yeah, we're doing well. <laughs> Look who I spotted. <laughs> He's got the good stuff. Oh, finally. <laughs> Here, wait, oh, I don't need this cold water. So we finally made it to Vegas, woo! It didn't just take us, I don't know, four hours, <laughs> but we're glad we're here and now we have to go to the New Orleans Hotel and find some parking and check in and then head over to the car show. So, we're excited. <laughs>
to go home we don't want to leave but we have to <laughs> we're walking on this broken oh, escalator fuck. it's so quiet there yeah. it's like a ghost town <laughs> Had such a great time. My feet are killing me and my 
my hair is hating me right now, so uh, yeah, <laughs> it was all good time. Now I'm just about to fall on the road, just looking windswept. That parking, where is the sign? It is sparkling, you can't see it. So, now it's time to find the car, which should be easy, I think. <laughs> but yeah, I have a really shiny face now. <laughs> Oh hey. oh hey! Oh hey! Look, I have such a shiny face. <laughs> Some more cars. It's kind of look how low it is, like the the roof. And this one. journey back to LA and it is what, 11 o'clock at night. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah we should have stayed or slept in the car but yep we are making the trip back. Oh my god. When the fog is oh, it's real better now. guys it's better now. you literally can't see a thing our day to day and my voice is going and our day to day has been crazy enough and now we're in the fog. Yep, having some fun. Oh, it is so bad. You can hardly see like everybody in the motorway is literally crawling. We have just stopped for some fuel because it was on the red and we thought we could make it home and we for sure couldn't <laughs> and I'm all wrapped up in my coat now because I'm cold but I am losing my voice <laughs> and I am so tired I am so sleepy I just want to go home and sleep yep but we're nearly home like I'm 30 minutes and then I can go to bed I'm so excited so Finally, time for bed. I have never been so excited in a long time. <laughs> Good night. So what do you guys think? Is it something that you would go to? For me, personally, I definitely would go again. It was so much fun and I'm sorry I didn't get more footage. I was trying to film and then say hi to everybody and experience it. It was crazy and we only had a few hours to really to see things and to experience it but it was so much fun you guys i would definitely recommend it to anyone that loves the 40s 50s 60s honestly even if you don't even like the wearing vintage clothes but you love the music or just want a good time i would definitely recommend viva it's just it's a, just a great experience and you're there around everybody that loves the same thing that you love and you meet amazing people, so I definitely would recommend it. So basically, I'm going to be filming different types of videos. There's going to be a new one coming up very soon, and it's a vintage haul, because I know you all like to see what clothes I get and where I get them from. So I've decided that I'm going to start putting them on the YouTube channel, so even if you miss seeing what I had from that store that one time, because Instagram only holds it for 24 hours, then at least if they're on YouTube, you can come back and watch. And if you're like, well, where did that top come from? You can at least go back and you can say, oh, it's from here and you can find it. So yeah, so stay tuned because there is so much more coming. And thank you so much again for all of your support. It means a lot to me. So have a great day.